Good morning, Capricorns. Hello, everybody. Happy May 1st, everybody. I have Tarot of the Mystical Moments for the main deck. I have Wheel of Fortune Tarot for the clarifying deck, and the links to these decks can be found down below in the description box. Queen of Wands, Aries, Virgo, Knight of Pentacles. Feels like something is really finally going somebody's way. That's what I'm getting. Knight of Pentacles is moving in the right direction, methodically laying the groundwork for something long lasting to stay. Um, it could be it, it could be a work, it could be a newer job, it could really be getting on top of something that has recently been out of control. And the Queen of Wands is really confident and it just feels really happy. Queen of Wands, Seven of Pentacles Reverse, and the King of Swords, leaving something that is a bad investment behind. So I like this energy. It just feels like in control, you know, mastering the one's uh, emotions going on here. All right, let's see what's going on. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Capricorn. If you are a Capricorn, know a Capricorn, feel like being a Capricorn. Cappies, I'm glad you're here. You could be a Capricorn and this resonates. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. It could resonate as the main story and Capricorn can be the cross watcher. This reading could be about a Capricorn or for Capricorn. Take it as it resonates. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Well, okay. Nine of Cups. Oh, is this about love? Is somebody, are you, are you, what is this Knight of Cups about? Pisces energy. What's influencing, that's a very romantic energy. What's influencing the Knight of Cups? What's influencing the Knight of Cups? Six of Swords. Moving toward, it feels like a connection's finally moving on. I mean, moving, moving forward. How about we say that? Somebody wants to do this. That's what I'm getting. Somebody wants to invest here. There's your queen of pentacles right there. What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? Ten of cups, Cappy. Pisces again, happily ever after. What's in the past? Eight of cups. Now, interesting because the eight of cups is walking away from something, something that you don't know what's on the other side, but you're willing to do it. See the transformational in the tunnel that she's walking the path. Some of you, this person's walking towards you. Somebody might even be leaving somebody for you. But the six of swords is saying, hey, I, I can't deal with what I was dealing with anymore. It's time for me to focus on me on healing. See how she's focused on the star and ready to drop an anchor in a new um, exotic land over here. But it feels like moving towards love. And for some Capricorns, maybe you're moving for love somewhere else. And maybe somebody's coming towards you. What is on Capricorn's mind? What is on Capricorn's mind? What is on the Capricorn's mind? Ooh, that's a lot that flipped. Nine of Wands, Ten of Wands, Seven of Swords, Ace of Wands, Chariot Reverse. You have two tens already. Ace of Wands. It's interesting because after a Ten of Wands is an Ace of Wands. I almost get a third party vibe on this, to be honest. Something that has been very difficult and all on your shoulders, you're ready to shrug off for the new. See how she's focused on this one flower, but she's too overloaded to even deal with what it is that she needs to do. Um, right after that is, and I feel like there's something you put on the back burner for a long time because maybe you've worked a lot. Um, something just took priority in your life because even this flower is in, in behind and there's something that's been very difficult hence the, the the scars on her nine of wands ten of wands there's a progression to something new ace of wands you are there capricorn seven of swords is solving a major problem now i just did taurus's reading they had this card in the same position seven of swords is solving a problem right getting away from something successfully that has ended, chariot reverse. It feels like somebody may ask you out or you might propose an idea to somebody and say, hey, let's just go away. Or I, I wanna come see you. It feels sudden, I'll be honest, it feels sudden because there's a little bit of what to do, what to do, what to do. So I almost, I kind of feel like this might take you by surprise. What's in the near future? What's in the near future for Capricorn? 
two cards. There you are, four of pentacles, queen of swords reverse. I want one more card there. What's in the near future? Because queen of swords reverse is keeping oneself back. Four of pentacles looks like she's keeping herself back behind this gate. I feel, that's why I feel like some someone's coming towards you. I feel like you're here. Six of swords is literally coming to your house. That's what it looks like. Somebody's traveling, knight of cups, and she's she's at home she's not she's in a good place this is a very stable place but a queen of swords reverse tells me they your picture might be on a milk carton somewhere because nobody has seen you you know that's that's the queen of swords reverse it's kind of like she is really withdrawn so i feel like somebody i feel like somebody's showing up physically at your place what's in the near future what's in the near future I, that's you know what that's what that Ten of Cups, I think, is. Ten of Cups is a rainbow after a period of rain and a storm. She's riding the storm cloud out of there towards that Ten of, Club, Ten of Cups. What's in the near future for Capricorn? High Priestess Reverse. No, <clears throat> Capricorn, I feel like this is you. See how she's... <clears throat> I'm sorry, all of a sudden I'm losing my voice. See how she's keeping herself behind the curtain but looking at a distance? I feel... Like, you don't want to maybe make the first move. Or maybe you did, Ten of Wands, all you could do in a situation, but somebody's still in something. And you're saying, you know what? I'm going to stay over here. Come find me when, when you're ready. They find you. Honestly, they find you. Nine of Pentacles, there you are. King of Cups. There's a lot of love here, and there's a lot of movement and travel your way. And I feel like somebody wants to make it up to you. That's what it feels like. They want to make up maybe make up but i do feel like somebody wants to make it up to you if they made you feel you don't mean anything to them you know what's the knight of cups center of the reading pisces energy what's this knight of cups center of the reading knight of cups center of the reading here justice reverse I'm trying to think a song just popped in my mind from the was it 90s is it ready for love? It feels like making love. Who sings that? I I don't know where that came from in my mind. Feel like making love. You guys know, do you guys know that song? Anyway, that's so weird. Justice Reverse is, I feel like somebody's out of something. I do. That feels like a breakup, divorce, leaving something behind for for something better. Six of Swords is moving forward happily, taking that full energy and going, taking a chance. What's the Six of Swords influencing energy? Did I get a flipper? No. What's the Six of Swords influencing energy? King of Pentacles reverse. You're the Queen of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles upright, King of Pentacles reverse. Why do I feel like this king was attached to maybe a queen of wands reverse? Somebody they have nothing in common moving towards their other half. Why the, why the ten of cups? Reason for the reading? Pisces energy. What's this ten of cups? Two cards. King of cups reverse and the seven of cups reverse. So seven of cups reverse is an ace of cups upright. I know what I need to do. I'm not no longer feeling held back, no longer confused. I know what I want, which is why there's an ace of wands on somebody's mind. Seven of cups reverse is rooted in reality that this is the person for me. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know why I didn't invest in Capricorn sooner. I don't want Capricorn to get away. I feel like somebody wants to make something up to you and they want to do it in person. King of cups reverse is King of Cups reverse, I feel like it's just, it's like they know what this connection is, you know? What's this Eight of Cups in the past, Pisces energy? Page of Cups, Eight of Wands, Knight of Wands reverse. Gosh, it feels like, it feels like somebody went a different direction. Because remember, okay, King of Cups reverse, it's depicted a lot with ships, King of Cups. See the ship at a distance? I almost feel like you saw the ship go away. And then maybe you're like stable now. You know what I mean? You're not you're not destitute over somebody. I would almost feel like there's like this 
few months. I, I don't know why three months is popping in my mind, but it just feels like there's this time where you thought something was over. But they couldn't get you out of their system. Knight of Wands reverse. You probably walked away thinking, well, they're gone. Eight of Wands. They went a different direction. So you chose to walk away and got yourself back up on your feet. Ace of Wands on your mind. What's this Ace of Wands on Capricorn's mind? Six of Wands. You add those together, you got the Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands is getting a lot of attention. But it, it's also defending your position, feeling like you have to defend your position. Because I feel like somebody's fighting for you. And this might be an energy that didn't even show you much attention. All of a sudden, they're love bombing you. And the Seven of Swords is like, is this somebody slithering in and slithering out? What's this Chariot Reverse on Capricorn's mind? Chariot Reverse on Capricorn's mind. Nine of Cups Reverse and the world. You don't want to be the, what is that called? Where you win second place. What is that called? Like the... My brain is not working. You don't want somebody by default. You want somebody, you want to be somebody's only cup. You don't want to be somebody's seven of cups, right? I feel like this person's coming back. And I feel like they want to make it up to you, but I don't think you trust them. I think they did you dirty back here. All right, what's this four of pentacles? And queen, queen of, or I'm sorry, the high priestess reverse. Yeah, eight of cups reverse. So this is how I'm feeling. And there's that full energy. I told you, higher fan. Somebody's coming in hard. No pun intended. Maybe pun intended for some of you dirty dogs. Somebody is coming in hard at you here. You got the higher fit and you got the fool. Below that is a judgment reverse. So I do think you know this person who I'm reading for. I think somebody did you wrong. And you picked up your flowers and moved the hell on. Justice reverse is getting the short end of the stick. But I do feel like this King of Pentacles is out of something. I feel like when you moved on from them, they started to be like, wait a second. I thought they would wait. Did I make, the, did I make a mistake leaving back here? So it's interesting because you got an Eight of Cups in the past, but you got an Eight of Cups reverse in the future. Somebody doesn't want to, oh, look at that. And you got the world on your mind. And this Eight of Cups is the world. I feel like somebody doesn't want you to move on from them. They don't want you to forget them. They want you to want them again. But are they sticking around this time? It is a higher fit. It is a fool. So I do feel like somebody's coming in and say, let's give this a real shot. I want to make it up to you. Um, Nine of Swords reverse is a good card. You got two nines reverse, actually, which is these are two nines you want reverse. Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, you would want upright. These are two cards you would want reverse because this is not worried anymore. This is no longer keeping oneself back. A Nine of Wands reverse is an Eight of Wands upright because she is a Page of Wands holding her Eight of Wands back, pacing back and forth like a lion. But when it's reverse, she doesn't need to pace anymore. She doesn't need to overthink anymore. Somebody is in your face. I'm telling you, you're going to be surprised to see this person at your door. Nine of Pentacles upright, King of Cups. The ship is coming back in, it's Capricorn. And they want to make it up to you. They want to make it up to you. That's, it, it's either going to be a reading or not. That's, that's really, this feels so cut and dry. It really does. But I just don't know if you can trust them. That's the thing. All right, Cappies, have a great rest of your week and take care.